Okay, I thought I'd pick up the camera because we're having a hurricane. We're getting a hurricane and what is going on? Is that you? Are you growling? I can't tell if Tank is growling or if it's like outside. Arabella's playing on her mat right now. I'll show you guys what the outside looks. Okay, it's like really not that bad out. I don't know if you can see the lake over there, but it's just kind of windy. And here is my marshmallow girl playing with all of her toys. Huh? She's playing with all of her toys and Tanky. Tanky, don't lick her. But I thought that since it's a hurricane, let's film. So I thought it would, thought it would be fun to film every single day for this hurricane. because I need to get it back into filming and it's really hard to do when you have a six month old. She's finally six months, so I think I'm gonna do kind of like an update in this video as well. We're gonna do an update. Guys, look how big she's getting. <coughs> I know you're getting big. She loves all of her toys. That's a love every uh, little rattle. Speaking of love every, they sent us a nice little package. We're gonna open, right? Do you wanna open your gift? They sent us some stuff. Yeah. I'm so excited. Are you excited? <gasps> Loves it. I'm so happy. Are you happy? Yeah, you want to open it? Should we open it now? I swear, love Everly toys. All of them are like her favorite toys ever. Let me find a knife to open. What did Mimi get? You want to see? Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Are you so excited? Dang! Let's open it! Ooh, look at the baby! <gasps> okay, let's see what we got. Tank! Stop! Tank is excited as well. Okay, so this is how the box comes. First thing are these like little tiny cups. This would be amazing to teach her. Put that right there. So this comes in every single box, I believe. It's kind of like the tips and tricks and basically everything. Stop biting the box. Okay, so I'm pretty sure every single box comes with one of these. It's the ways to play, expert tips, development, info, at home activities. Are you getting down? What are you doing, girl? Let's see what's in here. <gasps> flashcards! We love flashcards. And these are really cool because you can like feel it almost. We're so going to be doing this. Next thing is like this little basket. I have no idea what these are. Let's open them up. How fun. Little tiny balls. Okay. <laughs> Arabella's already playing with them. But some of them are super hard. Some of them are kind of like fluffy. Which is really good for her to kind of experience both. And we have this. Oh, so this must be for the balls. What do you do when you're looking at them? Wow, let's see. <gasps> How cool. That is so cool. She's going to love this. Next little box. I don't know if I can open this with one hand. Let me try a little cup. I don't know if this is for like drinking or really what it is, but it's cute. And then the last thing is this. I have no idea whose baby that is, but it is the baby's really cute. Thank you, Love Every. Say thank you. Thank you for sending us this amazing little box. <laughs> Are you happy? You get on new toys? Okay, I'm going to make myself lunch. It's right now 1.20 and I'm starving. Um, Arabella just woke up from her nap maybe 20 minutes ago, so she's basically okay for right now. So she'll play on the floor really quick. I'm going to clean up like a little bit and yeah. Okay, so I gave Arabella kind of a snack right now um, since she did just wake up. She's been obsessed with beech nut 
anything beech nut really. So we have the veggies one for lunch, but in the morning she normally has she normally has the fruit ones in the morning and she really really likes them or even before dinner she'll have this one. But lately she's obsessed with these like little cheetahs we call them. That's what she's eating right now. And then also these like little tiny teethers she likes. Huh. And of course Tank has to sit right next to her because she drops a lot of food. Let me turn on some lights. Okay, so I bought this huge watermelon because Arabella recently tried watermelon the other day and she loved it. So I think I'm going to cut some up for her so she can eat it. And then the rest I'll just save for myself and Sam. So look how cute this is. I think it's adorable, but I think she's too little for this. <laughs> she's only six months. Time to cut this. I think I'll just put it in a bowl. So what's been going on in my life? Let me put my hair up really fast. Okay, so basically what's going on with us? Sam is going away again for work. Arabella's starting to eat real food, which is like really cool. She like loves trying new things. Recently, she's been loving pickles, which is shocking because I hate pickles. Like I can't eat like a full pickle. That like, would drive me crazy. Um, what else? I would show you guys the apartment. However, it's dirty and needs to be picked up and we don't have all of our furniture. We still need like a coffee table and some patio furniture, but I love living here like everything we'd hope it would be. I did buy some stuff for fall. I'll show you guys some of that as well. What else, what else? Yeah, we've just been like super busy. I forgot to do a five month update on Arabella. So we skipped one month, which I'm kind of upset about because I feel like looking back on when she was four months on the video on that, like she's changed so much, it's so crazy. Yeah, okay, let me cut this. You guys can't even see it. Maybe right here, whoa. Whoa. Okay, you guys can barely see me, but that's okay. I don't know like how to really cut this. I should probably do this with, I don't know what kind of knife, I don't know. Is there like an easy way to cut a watermelon? Please let me know. I should have just bought the chunks, honestly, but this would have been, this was cheaper and you get way more so i was kind of like why would i get the chunks when i could get more why is this so hard to cut okay that was like the worst cut of all watermelons but doesn't matter because i got the job done okay i'm gonna cut this really fast because arabella's attention span is not that long and She's right there and getting fussy, so let me cut this and then I'll get back to you guys. Okay, literally it is. 4.30 now. I've been on the couch watching YouTube. Arabella's crying, crawling. And yeah, I cleaned up the kitchen. I made her a couple squeezy packs. Tell them. Show you guys what they look like. I used some of the watermelon to make her some squeezy packs. And yeah, I think right now I'm gonna try some coffee. Should I? It's like 4.30. YOLO. Um, I did get some coffee. I've been hooked on Dunkin' Donuts. My kid needs me, hold on. So I've been obsessed with the Dunkin' Donuts coffee, but they were out of it at Publix, so I just got the Delight iced coffee and mocha. I'm gonna pour some and try it. mocha flavor and I've been getting 
Dunkin Donuts literally every single day, but since we're having a hurricane, I don't want to leave the house. Let's try this. First taste, it looks like chocolate milk. Not bad. I swear Arabella is not crying. She's doing perfectly fine. Oh, she's just dramatic. You good? Mimi. Anyways. This kind of does taste like chocolate milk though. Show everyone your new earrings. Let's show them. Say guys, I got my ears pierced. I got my ears pierced. Tell them. Oh. I got little tiny diamonds in my ear. Say hey guys. It's been a minute. Oh, sis. Okay, I'm gonna put her on her love everything mat and do some laundry. hangers for my pants I've had no hangers since we moved in like pant hangers and it's been bothering me so I ordered some and they finally came so now that I have time I'm gonna hang up all my pants also I have to show you guys this so Arabella has been trying to stand up a lot more and fortunately her tub is not doing it anymore like she's just way too big and she tries to oops she tries to stand up in it obviously that's not gonna work so we had to get rid of the bath so instead now she has a little seat I don't know if you guys can see it. It's a little seat. It's so cute. All of her little bath toys. She loves tubby time. Like, it's her favorite thing in the world. Who are you talking to? Who are you talking to? Oh. Say hey, guys. Tell them. Hi, guys. I'm six months old. Tank, stop, bud. Okay. So I forgot to show you guys what I bought for like home decor for fall, kind of. Um, I only bought like a couple things, not like anything too much and too crazy. But I got this little tiny pumpkin. I thought it was so cute. Um, I think I got this at TJ Maxx. Then I got this candle, TJ Maxx. It's a pumpkin, but I'm only lighting the middle right now. Hand soaps. They smell really good. Okay, well, these pillows aren't perfect right now, but we got some pillows. They're huge. And then we also got these curtains because we didn't have any. Um, we have blinds, but we like to keep this open, but we wanted, like, something obviously right there. And then we also got, like, a new comforter. I mean, you can't really see it now because our room's a mess, but we got, a, like, a tannish comforter. And it is so comfortable. We got this at Target. I also got new nails. I'm going to try these out. Um, so I have like the gel glue. I just have to like try them. But how cute for like Halloween. We have a couple's engagement photo shoot coming up. So I'm going to wear those. And then these are just like a light purple French tip. And then these are kind of like crazy. Um, I'm just hoping they're not too long. But yeah, that's like about it. That's kind of all that's new. We're waiting out the storm. It's getting super windy. I'll show you guys outside right now. Um, it's getting really, really windy and pretty rainy. The storm is supposed to hit tomorrow. So we'll see. This is what it looks like. Be 
yeah. Next thing I'm going to do is make dinner for me and Sam and probably take a shower because my hair looks disgusting.